Oh, and I think he brought me flowers. Hi. Yeah, it's actually a money bouquet. A money bouquet? <laughs> I, know, I know you people like, you like, you like money. Bad idea, bro. I already know that this video is not going to end well. So oh, yeah. I just used the money that I had used for the oh, flower to buy. Oh, okay. <laughs> How much were the flowers you were going to get me? One. I see ones and fives. No, there's a 20 in there somewhere. Where? There's a 20. There's at least there's, there's one right here. There's one 20. That should have been a forefront, you know. It's a little cheap, but it's okay. Uh, you don't deserve anything. Not even a penny. You should be lucky that he brought you that. That kind of stuff right there is reserved for like quinceañeras and, and stuff like that for like teenagers, bro. Like, you don't do that on no first date trying to meet someone. You giving her money. And look, she's embarrassing you because she's saying it. That's not even enough money when it don't even belong to her. How am I cheating? Che how much flower do you typically get? I get a lot of flowers and people go full out. Are you going full out? People don't go full out. Stop lying. Stop lying. <laughs> it's okay. So, no, it's, it's not, don't worry. What you mean, don't worry? No, it's, it's you're, you're not going to get my bouquet? Oh, now you want the money? But it wasn't good enough. So now you want it, though. <laughs> I mean, it's cool. You got your little Jesus sandals on, whatever. Now, why you got to bring Jesus into the conversation? So you have to insult the man because he don't want to give you the bouquet of money that you didn't want, that you frowned upon. Now you got to insult the way the guy's dressed with them sandals on. If he likes the sandals, let him rock his sandals. At least he don't have white socks on. Yeah, why you come on a date like that? Ooh, and I... You know, what I will say about this is that, bro, when you, I can see you walking up, you're giving off some feminine energy. That's already something she's not going to respect. You come in with this bouquet uh, of, of money flowers. She's not respecting that because she says, wow, this guy's giving me money. Don't even really know me like that. I don't deserve it. So you're automatically getting disrespected before you even reach her. You got to be more masculine, dude. Stop giving these women things that they don't deserve. Why does she deserve that? You could have saved that money. You could have gave it to your mama, your sister, whoever it is. Kept it in the bank. Saved it. Do what you need to do. Stop giving these women things that they don't deserve because they don't respect you. Now, she's going to embarrass you to the tilt because it wasn't enough money. Oh, all I see is dollars. Where's the 20? Oh, it should be in the front. When she doesn't deserve any of that at all. And it's funny that she's not even in this video, but she got you on blast. And what I would say about them sandals, you need to have your safety in mind, bro. Walking around like that with them type of sandals on, you know, you're not protecting your feet. It's not really a good look. You got the super tight pants on with the sandals. You know, you're not coming up being masculine you know your body movements and all of that you know what i'm saying you're coming up with the money you got the big smile on your face you know one thing i will tell guys all the time and it's something that you have to learn as a guy um you have to understand that women are always testing men they're always testing your masculinity they want to see what you're gonna let them get away with it usually starts with an insult some kind of slide a uh, snide remark or something like that just to see how you're going to react they make comments and do things to see if you're going to stay in your masculine frame or if you're going to let them disrespect you the minute they see that you're going to let them disrespect you all bets are off they go all in and they keep going and keep going and keep going now see had he stopped her when she first started disrespecting him she wouldn't even got a chance to say something about his sandals or to say something about the money, that that flower money bouquet. You see what I'm saying? Guys, you have to understand that. Just like we look at women and we're testing their femininity, um, how they look, how they dress, how they talk, how they move in the world, you know, the character, how they are around people. Women are doing the same thing to men. Women want to be with masculine men. They don't want to be with simpy men. 
they don't respect simpy men they don't respect men that act real feminine like that they will just use those men just because they're taking something from you it doesn't mean that they respect you so you got to protect yourself be smart go hit the gym go hang out with your boys get into some masculine activities because this whole narrative that society has taught men to be soft and weak and and simps and all of that it doesn't work and the proof is in the pudding all you got to do is look at the stats look at the state of all the relationships that we have now look at all these women that are unruly and disrespectful to men look at all the men that are soft and pandering to women and giving them exactly what they want because they just want to get next to the woman so bad that they're just going to do and say anything to try to do it but women will never respect it i don't care if that's a a real bouquet of flowers she still don't deserve it bro and you're just making yourself look weak you have the power to achieve anything you want don't let anything or anyone distract you from your goals and remember stay focused stay strong and stay positive make sure to like subscribe and share this video with those in need